Hello, um, I mentioned this in my last video, but I wanted to redo my BTS binder. I wanted to spice it up a little bit. I wanted to change it, like it just wasn't, I don't know, I just felt like I needed a change. So this is a bit of a binder maintenance video. So if you're not into that, don't watch it. But if you just want to hear me talk shit for like however long this takes, keep watching. Um, so I have just some extra sleeves and stuff in here, but I have sleeved, I've already taken out most of my BTS album cards and I've re-sleeved them into different sleeves. You can see the white and the clear. Um, just to save time, I think, whatever. Um, but I dropped this pile of cards like two minutes ago and so they might not be in order anymore so when that happens and i come to a card that's not in the right order then whatever we'll do with it then um but i yeah like i said i wanted to change up my bts binder and i decided to collect a third member um so i'm essentially just gonna set up for that and hopefully rearrange my collection a little bit so it's not I don't know I just wanted to change it up it's okay to change things up so I'm gonna start off with now I'm gonna do them back to back because I want to save space um, I used to collect OT7 and I loved looking at the backs of the cards especially the Love Yourself series. Um, I'm still a bit sick, so don't mind my voice. But especially the Love Yourself series, like those, the backs of those cards are so pretty. But it's been a few years and I feel like it's time for me to focus on saving space um, with my collection. My dog is up. Oh, my dog is on my bed and she tried to chew <laughs> my sleeves. Um, so, <laughs> she's so funny. Um, hopefully she'll behave while I put these cards away. I'm just going to move this across a little bit. Um, I'm sitting in a weird, awkward position. So, <laughs> hold on. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to reach that side without, like, having to, like, full-on stretch. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh my god. But yeah, I wanted to pick up Hobie. Um, which is like funny because I used to collect Hobie with my OT7 sets and stuff. But when I sold my OT7 sets, I sold... Oh, I put them in the wrong spot. Um, yeah, when I sold all my OT7 extra cards I also sold Hobies so it's a bit funny to me that I'm going back and what am I doing <laughs> this is already a mess I've my brain today is just not working um some of the cards I'm not gonna go back and collect Hobie for for example like these group cards I'm just gonna keep the group cards I have this Tay card I'm ooh, I'm just going to keep the Tay card, um, stuff like that, just to like save my coin. Um, but yeah, I just really, I don't know, I just felt like picking up three members because I just think it looks so good <laughs> on a spread. And look at this, I've already saved an extra page. Um, I think I'm going to put this one down. Now with the Love Yourself... PCs, I'm, they're not going to be in order, um, they're just going to be in like whatever order I want to put them in, so yeah, I'll put in white fillers at the end, but oh, oh you know what, I should have put Jimin in the middle, so it's in age order, <laughs> but then all of the groups won't be, in the, I don't know, I don't know.
Yeah, okay. I'll put Jimin in the middle for age order. Um, but yeah. And, um, Yoongi. Another Yoongi album is coming out soon. Now, this one, I'm not collecting Hobie for because this is my favourite Namjoon PC, like, ever. So I'm just going to keep it. Um, and yeah. And then my JK. I also might do a little bit of downsizing in this video. It depends how long it gets. Um, because there's... I, like, seriously, seriously need to downsize. Um... It's a bit like this binder is so full and it's only the album and DVD sort of stuff and like Japanese albums and stuff. Cute. Actually, I quite like that. It's a little bit not in the center, but that's okay. All right, I'm going to move these big cards out. And we will continue with tier. But yeah, what was I saying? Oh, what am I doing? I do like kind of miss collecting OT7, so that's why I've sort of set up a section at the back of this binder. Um, my voice is dying. Um, that I will keep my OT7 seven sets like sort of like what I do with Stacy. I don't know if like if you guys have seen how I organize Stacy, but I don't know I'm just excited to rearrange my BTS collection because I haven't because it's been complete for so long um just like keeping up with you know whatever albums come out um but leave this one because it's too big um but yeah I just like it's been the same for so long and I just wanted to change it like I just felt like it wasn't not not that it wasn't making me happy but just like it, it was just sitting on the shelf like untouched um sort of thing so I just wanted to you know spice it up a little bit jazz it up a little bit I wanted to just full on rearrange it. I, in general, I'm starting to collect less of non album things. I know that sounds really silly um, because all the time I'm like, oh, pre order benefits or, oh, you know, like season greetings. Um, but I do want to sort of slow down on the non album things and only focus on album cards for the groups I collect. Um, because it's getting a bit much, because I started, let's move this back, I started only collecting BTS, so I only collected, I'd actually started off, I only collected who I pulled, and then I decided to collect who I pulled, but also like human equivalent, and then I decided to collect OT7, so I had like OT7 complete for all of the eras up until Love Yourself and then trying to complete OT7 for Love Yourself back then was so hard because like you, it was really it wasn't that easy to get BTS albums in Australia like compared to what it is like now because now you can just go down to you know the shops and they're there but um <clears throat> 2017 it was like you had to order online and then you had to try and trade and it was just like I just couldn't be bothered so but yeah I'm really excited to collect Kobe as well um 3J 3 Slay <laughs> Was really stupid of me to say um but yeah this is where 
I've got a group card here, but I will probably get Hobies and then swap it out. Um, but yeah, this is where it's going to get a little bit confusing. So this is, the, they're the cards that I have, oh, have sleeved up until now, but I'm just going to take out these butter, oh sorry, B cards. Now I'm going to take out all of these because this is where it's going to get confusing. I need to reorganize all of this completely, but I didn't know which cards I were going to sleeve with the white sleeves which cards I was going to sleeve with the clear sleeves. So I just wanted to get all of these cards in first and then go from there. <clears throat> so what comes next? I'm thinking of doing the B pre-order benefits. Now I need to get um, JKs. Because I originally was only going to collect Jimin for the Weverse pubs, um, but I also pulled Hobie. He's just been like chilling in a little box um, <laughs> for like ages, and I completely forgot I even had him. And then I found this card, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna collect 3J for the pubs as well. So that means I do have to get JKs. But that's all right. I've seen it for sale quite a bit and the prices have gone down like significantly. Um, it's actually quite interesting <clears throat> seeing the prices for BTS go down. Because a lot of things, I mean, a lot of the things I already have, but a lot of DVD cards and stuff like that, um, the prices this time two years ago was so crazy, but now people are starting to sell them cheaper. And I think it's because a lot of people are just dropping their BTS collections. This card keeps sliding around and it's annoying me. Do I, I don't, I don't have hope he's one of that. Okay. Now this is where I'm confused. Do the weavers? Is this a weavers? But yeah, because like there's a lot of BTS cards being sold now, it's like easier to collect BTS, which is good. I'm where's my Jimin card? Okay, I worked out where my other Jimin card was. Um, but yeah. So, I don't really know what else to say now. I sort of lost my train of thought when I <laughs> thought I lost um, this human card. All right, I'm gonna put the cream version cards down the bottom, I think. I just have a hobby for this one. Cute. And then that means I need to re-sleeve these two with white sleeves. Also, ignore my nails. Um, I had nails on, but then I ripped them off the other day because I was sick of them so now my nails look a little bit crusty but that's okay I'm gonna redo them okay doing this I've stumbled across some like really like gross sleeves okay well see we've saved so many pages already I'm gonna take out these now all right Let's do the proof pre-order benefits. These will need to be sleeved white as well. But I 
have Herbie's for this. I just need to get JK's and I think, I think I have it on the way because I ordered it, but I'm not sure if it's been canceled or what. Um, and there's my other members page, bro. Where are all of my cards? Seriously, I'm a little bit silly. Here. I need to take out, so I'm going to reorganize this section too. I'm going to take out this one. I'm going to take out this one. I think they're the same. I think. I'm going to take out this one. This one. I think I have the Herbie version of this one. Just trying to like conserve space. Okay. Which means I need to take out Jimin's, some of Jimin's lucky drawers. Which will actually work out well. And this one. And this one. Okay. Let's go back. I actually forgot to put in the Japanese um, butter pre order benefits. So I'm going to move all of these down. I still don't have my face albums. <laughs> They're still in Korea and I'm getting impatient because I want to see which Jimin cards I pulled. Um, but yeah. Oh wait, oh wait, I've made an error. I, I want to put in the lucky draws with the album cards. I know it's a bit silly, but if I've got all three members, why not? That's butter. This one is for B. So we'll do the lucky draws after. So we'll do the pobs first, album cards, and then the lucky draws, I think. So that means they'll go here. So I'm a little bit all over the place today. The, the B lucky draws are just so freaking cute. Okay, and then I have JK's and Hoobies, which will go here, and here, cute, that actually look really nice I think, and then we've got the, I want to put the Brain not working. Brain not working. I want to put what comes next? B butter. So let's put the butter. I want to put the butter pre order benefits away. And then hope this will go there. And then I want to put the Butter Japan um, pre-order benefits away. I have the Jimin's. He will go in the middle. Oops. And then, where did I put my junk? I'm just going to quickly put it in a white sleeve. And then I have Herbie's on the way. Cool. 
And then we can do the album cards. So I want to do the cream version first. I, I know it's like peaches and cream, but the cream version sort of matches the other cards more. <laughs> Does that make sense? Like, Herbie's has a, an orange background and it will match the orange. You know what I mean? And then JK. My dog is sleeping on my bed and she's like half off. Like her half of her body is just like flopping off the side of the bed. <laughs> she's so cute. Alright, and then we can do these album cards. And then we can do the butter lucky drawers. Oh, I thought I had Herbies of this one, but maybe I don't, but maybe I do, because I bought the set, so I had all seven of them at one point, but I can't remember if I sold it or if I put it elsewhere, but anyways, these will go up here, so I'm just going to re-sleeve them into a clear sleeve. photo cards so I've got Herbie's I actually pulled um, Herbie's and I bought Jimin's so now I just need to get JK's this sleeve's a bit dirty I might get another one. Oh, my dog's standing up now She's turning around. Cute. That is so cute. All right. And now we need to put in the album cards. So let's take those out. I will do the compact cards first, I think, because they match a little better. out these extra sleeves so I don't have to deal with them after okay and now we can do the um, what is this called the standard edition oh, my dog's gone now off she goes so I'm gonna put these in white sleeves excited to have my BTS collection like double sided like two page spread or whatever um, I'm just excited to save space like as I've gotten older I have sort of become more selective in what I want I say with a full binder but like you know what I mean you know what I mean I don't know I might get you know what I might get the other um, in the SOM cards and put them in the middle, maybe, and then keep Jimin's, um, whatchamacallit, collector's edition cards, because the collector's edition cards are kind of expensive. Um, I found Hobie's for a good price, but I cannot find JK's for a good price, and... I don't know if I want to just buy Jungkook's collector's edition cards for the sake of having them when they're that expensive, so I might just keep it like how it is. Um, I don't know how I ended up with two of these <laughs> Jimin cards. 
Maybe I'll get a Hobie one of like this version and I'll have like Hobie and Jib. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But for now, I will just do this. Um, my voice is seriously giving up. And I feel like I haven't even been filming for that long. I, I, like, I had like a chest cold and it's moved up to my head now. So now it's a head cold. But it's so cute and it ends so perfectly. And then I'll do my OT7. I'll, maybe I'll do that on my own time with white fillers. Um, and then my member solos. So three, three, three. And then this will be for Jimin's. Um, I've got two pages because I want to collect all of the album cards. I want to collect all of the lucky draws. And then I have Jimin's other lucky draws. So now we can... move these across I actually think that Loki looks better oh my goodness this page is completely wrecked these BCW pages I not my favorite not my favorite but I'll take these out and we can start again in this page See ya, gone. Um, I have this Ultra Pro sleeve. It's a little bit dusty, um, but I don't have any other ones. All right, take two. Now these are all jumbled up. Okay, we'll start off with my favorite ever lucky draw. I, it's just so pretty. And then this one. And then what was next? This one. And then I wanted to do the hollow ones in the middle. Mm. This one's a bit thick. So it's like not going in. Nicely. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right. And then. Oh, does this finish the page perfectly? That is actually so pleasing. It is so pleasing to me that it now I just have a nine page of lucky draws instead of like having random ones everywhere else. Oh, that makes me so happy. Oh my god. <laughs> Because then that will go there and it will finish the page perfectly. It's a little like it is a little a little annoying that I'm gonna have Jimin's um solo face lucky drawers with the album cards. I mean I guess I could put them on the back because there's nine of them. So that could work if I'd put them on the back. But I don't know, I kinda wanna keep his solo stuff together. I don't know. But I can get rid of this page now. Oh my goodness. Let's do a little flip through. All right, let's do a little flip through. I think I knocked this camera and I didn't even realize that you can see the box that I've got it on. Oh well. Okay. Let's put in some fillers. really excited it looks so good I don't even care that you can't see the backs I'm just excited to be saving space um, I might zoom out a teeny little bit oh my goodness and then I'm just like excited to be buying BTS album cards again like when I first was collecting Jimin and JK when I had died it decided to just focus on those two like finding the album cards was always so satisfying when you could find them for a good price and then putting them in the spot where it finishes the page was always so satisfying so I'm excited to like do that again it's probably not a healthy mindset to have like oh I'm gonna buy more cards now to you know feel the serotonin in my brain but whatever 
and I really like the way this looks like I just feel like it looks neater I don't know what do you guys reckon if you don't like it don't tell me I don't want to know <laughs> it'll hurt my feelings um but yeah I think I eventually want to move all of my collections to be like double-sided because I don't have a lot of room to store things anymore um so we'll see but then like I was thinking about oops I was thinking about doing it with like my twice collection I think it would look really nice with my twice collection but I use the thin binder pages for my twice collection but I could but I have like thin little white sleeves that fit in the thin binder pages so I don't know satisfying oh my god oh my god that is so satisfying and then Jim and Faye stuff and then lucky drawers now I might just leave my Japanese cards as is I don't know I need to think about it because Otherwise, I'm going to have like a page and a half of Japanese cards instead of like two pages. So it's not really worth at the moment, I think, to change all of that. I might just leave it for now. We'll see how I feel in the future. <laughs> um, and then these cards I want to keep. Um, I don't want to put white sleeves because they're quite wide. You can't really see the white sleeves anyway. Um, I'll just leave that as is. DVD cards I want to leave as is, as is because, I mean, this one's a replica, but some of them are double-sided, so I want to see the backs of them. So that's fine. I'll leave it like that. And then my other member cards. I'm just gonna shuffle down. I'm also gonna leave these without the white sleeves because I want to see the backs of these ones, at least I do for now, especially because this one and this one are double sided. So, oh, this one's not even sleeved. Oh my goodness. This is one of my favourite Namjoon cards. Like, I don't think I can ever get rid of it. So, he's chilling there. Let's put a couple of white sleeves in here. Actually, actually, I lied. I have these to put away. Need to re-sleeve this one too. Oh my goodness. Alright, and then I have this one last Yungi card. I will just put it on the back for now. Because there's really no point in having a whole page, you know, for nothing. Um, and then, like, I've got these promo card, like, merch sort of ad cards, promotional cards, that I kind of want to sell. I don't... I'm still thinking about it though. I'm still thinking about it. Cause like these Coca-Cola cards are so cute and I've had them for the longest time. Like I think it will really hurt my feelings to get rid of them. But like this page is not my favorite page. And then I moved, I did this like a couple weeks ago. I moved all of the bigger inclusions to the back. So that means I'm going to put all of these back in the back. So these will go here. And then I've also got the other album cards. 
this is my other dilemma because these are technically the album cards they're not like the postcards or whatever they don't even go there um so i don't know whether i should keep them with the album stuff but then i feel like that'll look messy because i at the moment i'm into like having all of the photo card sized things together and then having everything else away from the cards because i just think it looks neater for me personally um i don't know um any ideas would be appreciated about how to organize it but my bind has gone down a little bit um i still want to try and downsize a little bit more i say i want to downsize as i'm picking up a third member but oh my god it's gonna look so good when it's all done and it just like finishes perfectly with proof and then chapter two like bts chapter two will be like there i think that looks really good i'm sorry this is just so exciting for me um but yeah any ideas on how to like store my other bigger inclusions and stuff and my japanese cards i don't know maybe i don't know i don't know i don't know i don't know but um thank you for watching me rearrange my bts cards um i don't really organize my bts cards a lot on here because it's the collection has been sort of complete um so yeah i hope you enjoyed this little insight into my bts cards and such um i might do binder maintenance again in the future also might not if this video does really bad so yeah catch ya next time and stream face <laughs>